everybody. Welcome to week four of my Countdown to Christmas series. I hope you've been enjoying them. Today I have a really simple project for you, a way to wrap some candy or a small gift. These are our itty bitty muslin bags and they're so cute. You get eight of them for ten dollars and I mean you could really do so much with these, so many different holidays. This one I decided to just put a few of our chevrons using the Build-A-Banner kit chevron stencil. This comes in the Build-A-Banner kit. One thing I recommend is to put some adhesive behind the circle part up here. It'll kind of keep it from moving around a little bit and I even put some here on the side like that. That way you'll see it slips around and it gets kind of messy. You're going to need two of these sponge daubers and gumball green and cherry cobbler. And if you wanted to do just one color, I think that would be just fine as well. So I'm going to, I have it on my finger, I rubbed it on my very well inked pad. I made sure that it, I used my re-inkers to make sure it was very inked up and juicy. And I'm going to go along here and just daub through one of these chevrons. Before you switch over to gumball green, you're going to have to make sure that you clean off your stencil because I'm not sure if you can see it in the video, but this is very messy and it is all over the stencil. So I would take it off and let's see if I can grab my towel. Just Make sure I probably should take it off of there. Pull that out and I'm just gonna wipe it really good and get it off, okay? Now I'm gonna slide this back in here and I'm gonna line it back up. Like, well, I, it is actually one of the chevrons like that. So, let's see if I can get this all set up because I have the adhesive on there, it's sticking, but it, believe me when I tell you, it really helps keep it in place. All right, so now I've got it all stuck down again, and this time I'm gonna use the gumball green and do the same thing all the way through like this. All right, so cherry cobbler, gumball green, cherry cobbler is what I did. Now, to make the tag, I'm gonna go ahead and move on and show you the next part. So all I would need to do is one more cherry cobbler and I would be done. And you can do this also with the other stencils. We have stripes and polka dots. And I really think the polka dots are super cute. All right, so to make the tag, let's see where all of my goodies are. I stamped this sentiment right here, happy holidays to you and yours, from Joy to the World. And I stamped it in gumball green on Whisper White. And I took my um, Season of Style washi tape and I ran some below like this and I ran some above it like this and I'm gonna take this framelit right here and run it through my big shot. I'm gonna set it right there and I'm gonna run it through the big shot. So I'm gonna do that out of the camera really quickly so that I don't have to move everything around. The washi tape is so easy to use because it's already obviously has adhesive on it and it just tears. I just put it on there and tore it off. So there you have it, right? Just like that. And I made a, a bow with a gumball green satin ribbon and I'm going to attach that right there, a simple tag. And then you're just going to adhere it to the top and I used hot glue because I know it's going to probably come off but hot glue is going to hold it on. All right, that's a very simple way to dress up some of our basic gift giving items. I hope you enjoyed it and I'll see you next week. Thanks, bye-bye.